Oops. y'all what's up pepsi let me see what's going on here need to get some music right now where is it now oh that'll work pepsi man john happy thanksgiving let's get to the game appreciate y'all being here it's a tasty i hope y'all had a tasty day here we go mgs3 baby da 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 Hey Trevor. Hey Michael. Happy Thanksgiving, brother. Hey mate. Happy Thanksgiving, Trevor. What's up, buddy? I mean, if on the U.S., but you know what I mean. It's Happy Thanksgiving to anybody who wants to celebrate it with me. That's who I am, and I'm thankful for all of you guys. Woo! Let's go. I was going to decide the end's fate via donations if you'd like. Slash membership. Slash whatevs. What's going on? We'll get to that in a minute. We'll unlock that in just a few. Let's get this game going. That's right. Happy push stream. There you go. <laughs> At least that. We can celebrate that. Hey, Simba. What's up, buddy? I guess we'll load one. That the last one. What's the last one we did? Nikita! Probably this one. Let's go. Well, there we go. After the end of World War II, the world was split into two, East and West. This marked the beginning of the era called the Cold War. Hey, Poe. Happy Thanksgiving. What's up, yo? What's up, Poe? What's up, yo? How you doing? Ah! It's broken. It's, it, is it? Stream's coming in fine, right? Yes, yes. Thank you, Trevor. If only I could just grow my hair out and had thicker hair and grow a mullet, I'd be good. I'd be perfect. Yeah. What'd you do today, Pope? What's everybody been up to today? Flying over Pakistan, altitude 30,000 feet. Approaching Soviet airspace. Sounds good, Trevor. Appreciate you, man. 20 minutes to drop off. Commencing internal depressurization. Equipment check. Arm main parachute. All right. You ready to go? Drop zone still showing a high pressure mass. Cab okay. Good. We've got high visibility. Cigar. Connecting oxygen hose to interior connector. Put on your mask. Does this panty waste know what he's doing? Approaching release point. Ten minutes to drop off. Hey, are you deaf? He said, put out the cigar and put 
Depressurization complete. Checking oxygen supply. Six minutes to drop off. Opening rear hatch. Jack, I've got some important news. Do you now? The head of the CIA has finally given us the green light for the virtuous mission. Virtual mission? No, the virtuous mission. The future of our Fox unit depends on it. If it succeeds, we'll be officially organized into a unit. Virtuous mission? Sounds like some kind of initiation ritual. You know, don't get cocky. This isn't a training op. Right. So what exactly is this wonderful mission? <laughs> well... About two years ago, a certain Soviet scientist requested asylum in the West through one of our moles. His name is Nikolai Stepanovich Sokolov. He's head of the OKB-754 Design Bureau, one of the Soviet's top secret weapon research facilities, and the East's foremost expert on weapons development. Sokolov? Isn't he that famous rocket scientist? Oh, yeah. The very same. That's him, all right. On April the 12th, 1961, the Soviets achieved the first manned space flight. Try it, Andrew. But are we proud to be a Cowboys fan That's right now? God. <laughs> well spoken. <laughs> the carried Yuri Gagarin to orbit was the A-1, known as the Vostok rocket. Sokolov is said to be the man most responsible for the multi-engine cluster used in that rocket. After Gagarin's flight, Sokolov left rocket development Become the head of the newly established design bureau. From a lowly technician to head of a design bureau, that's quite a success story. So why do you want to defect? It seems he'd become afraid of his own creations. Afraid? Call it a crisis of conscience. And for that, he left his country and his family behind and went over the fence? Not exactly. One of his conditions was that his family was also to be taken safely to the West. We used a mole to get the family out first and succeeded in sneaking Sokolov over the Berlin Wall shortly after. Oh yeah, they didn't play a good game at all, but it I is what it is. Conducted the operation. The security on the eastern side was still full of holes back then. Then what? We got Sokolov over in one piece, but the whole ordeal had left him exhausted and we checked him into a hospital in West Berlin. It took him two weeks and more than 600 miles to get from the research facility in the Soviet Union to Berlin. He was in no condition to say anything coherent. And it was only a week later that we had something much bigger on our hands. The Cuban Missile Crisis. October the 16th, 1962, President Kennedy received word that the Soviets were in the process of deploying intermediate range ballistic missiles in Cuba. The President demanded that the Soviets dismantle and remove the missiles. At the same time, he announced a naval blockade to prevent further missile shipments from reaching Cuba. But the Soviets didn't back down, instead placing their armed forces on secondary alert. Soviet transport ships carrying missiles continued on course towards Cuba. U.S. and Soviet forces went on alert for an all-out nuclear war. Frantic negotiations were conducted Andrew, I don't, I don't know, know man. Security Council and unofficial channels to end the hair-trigger standoff. Finally, on October the 28th, 
the Soviet Union agreed to remove its missiles from Cuba, and so the world avoided a nuclear holocaust. But in order to get the Soviets to pull their missiles out, we had to make a deal. You mean the one where the US agreed to remove its IRBMs from Turkey? No. The Jupiter IRBMs deployed in Turkey were obsolete, and we were going to get rid of them anyway. They had no strategic value whatsoever to either the US or the Russians. The Turkey deal was a ruse, a cover story that was fed to the other intelligence agencies around the world. So what did the Russians really want? Sokolov. Nice, Andrew. Appreciate they you, buddy. To return Sokolov. You mean the Soviets pulled out of Cuba just to get their hands on Sokolov? That's right. What the hell was he working on? At the time, we had no idea. We were running out of time. It was either give up Sokolov or risk full-scale nuclear war. In the end, we had no choice. President Kennedy gave in to Khrushchev's demand. The next day, I got Sokolov out of the hospital, handing him over to agents on the eastern side. Sokolov kept on screaming, save me, until he saved me. my side. Then a month ago, we received some new information from one of our moles. About Sokolov? Yes. He was taken back to the research facility and forced to continue working on the weapon in question under KGB supervision. What's more, it's on the verge of completion. So what kind of weapon is it? Something to do with space rockets? No. Missiles. Same technology. I guess you're right. We don't know the details, but it appears to be a new kind of nuclear device. For half a year now, the Soviets have been conducting frequent nuclear... I'll tell you what, though, Andrew, though, uh... Something to do with the weapon, I... It seemed like the, We're uh, talking about a secret weapon so big... Refs really wanted to call pass well, interference on the Cowboys a lot, weren't they? Is Sokolov still in a facility? No. According to our intelligence, he's in Selino Yask, a place in the mountains about three miles to the west that's known as the Virgin Cliffs. The Virgin Cliffs? Nice name for a virtuous mission. They moved him there just recently. Why? Apparently, they're conducting a field test of the weapon, but it's our best chance to get him back. This mission would never have been possible if he was still in the research facility. This is our last chance. Sokolov must have known that too when he contacted us. Happy Thanksgiving, 98 Demon. What's up, buddy? Good to see you. Uh oh. Selino Yask in the Soviet mountains, ensure the safety of Sokolov and bring him back to the west. If we don't get Sokolov back before that weapon is complete, we'll be facing a major crisis. The clock is ticking. <laughs> Once we've confirmed the rescue of Sokolov, stand by at the recovery point. A recovery balloon will be dropped at that point. Helium will be pumped into the balloon to inflate it. The process takes about 20 minutes. Once it's complete, the gunship's arm will latch onto the balloon and pull it up. The Fulton Surface to Air Recovery System. I'm familiar with the theory. Take it easy. It's been combat proof. Do you think Sokolov is up to it? The shock will be less than during a parachute jump, and the arm can handle up to 500 pounds. So you're planning on going over the border in a single combat talent? She's equipped with two six-barrel 20-millimeter Vulcan cannons, as well as two 40-millimeter machine guns. Sounds like she could hold her own against a battalion of tanks. Even with the fuel in the reserve tank, we're facing a four-hour time limit. If all goes well, it shouldn't take more than a few hours. Home in time for dinner. But if anything goes wrong, you'll be eating dinner, breakfast, and all the rest of your meals in the jungle. Demon, 
nobody. In the jungle, mighty jungle, the metal gears will leave tonight. Do you copy? A copy. You're already in enemy territory. Come here. Somebody might be listening in. From here on out, we'll be using code names to refer to each other. You got it. Your code name for this mission will be Naked Snake. Oh, yeah. I'll be referring to you as Snake I'm from naked, now on. I'm naked, and I'm a snake. Not to mention your real name. Snake? What, you don't like snakes? What do you mean? Well, you've eaten one before, haven't you? Oh, yeah. In survival training. All the time. Yeah. Let I'm me glad to hear that. Snake. I don't know if I'd ever order one in a restaurant, but... Be careful. You might not have a choice. What about you, Major? What should I call you? Hmm, let's see. Yeah, Damon, sure. I'll be... I'll be Tom. Call me Major Tom. This will be Ooh, a time for dinner. Mission. You must not be seen by the enemy. You must leave no trace of your presence. Is that clear? This Got kind it. of infiltration is the Fox Unit's speciality. Speciality. In other words, Got it. weapons and equipment to procure on site. Happy Thanksgiving, that goes Major for food Tom. As well. You're completely naked, just as your name implies. I'm naked. Great. Now Great. I see why you asked me if I like snakes. Oh, well, I, I suppose snakes. calling me Snake was your idea of a joke too. No. There's a good reason for that. I'll tell you later when the yeah, time is right. Yeah, that's definitely a huge gotcha. nod. Getting back to the subject, to that how song. exactly am I supposed to feed myself? You've been issued also a knife. Also, too, the Great Escape movie. Use them to hunt for food. You'll also Found find some medical Harry. supplies in your backpack. Yeah, the tunnels they about create. the backpack. I lost it in a tree on the You'll way down. You'll see that later on. You didn't know I that see. already. Well, you may better have. go back and get it, then. You know where it is? No problem. I can see it from here. It's stuck on a branch. Yeah, I hadn't seen it yet, Andrew. Ah, it's a good movie. To climb a tree, stand in front of a tree that's covered in ivy and press the action button. I'll be monitoring your progress over the radio. We can't risk violating Soviet airspace, but I'll be in the gunship. Name, Steve McQueen, or My frequency is 140.85. And character in it. I'll give you a call if I need to talk to you. If you need to talk to me, use the send function. Okay, Snake. Go get your backpack. Get my backpack right now. I'm naked. I'm that naked. Timber. Give me some snakes, y'all. Tasty. Oh yeah, Damon. Ooh, that'd be cool if you can grab it like that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Demon, it was good. We had some turkey, some mashed potatoes, potato salad. We had some dressing, but it came backpack, out a little bit later because they're... Anyway, but it was uh, dressing. To equip well, a weapon, good. it's necessary to take it out of your backpack. I actually, I didn't stuff myself. In the survival I just, viewer, I ain't choose sure I was weapon from the backpack. Slightly full. Your available weapons will be displayed in the window in the so I'm proud of myself. From What's that up, Mariano? Place, choose the weapon you want to equip. 
and press button. the enter button. For other equipped items, just do the same thing like from that, item. Uh, Got it. Use the survival of a backpack. Um, yep, I, that's a right. Couple of small slices of Survival is good. fundamental to this mission. Pies. God After dang. you've been out in the field for a while, your stamina will start to drop. <laughs> kind of pause, if your stamina gets too low. Happy Thanksgiving, Mariana. Performance. You won't be able to shoot accurately, for example, and your wounds won't heal as smoothly. Got it. Keep an eye on your stamina so you don't run out. Got it. To recover lost stamina, you can hunt for local flora and fauna. You can use either your tranquilizer Ooh, gun or your you knife said. to hunt. My only weapon is a Mark 22 Hush Puppy tranquilizer gun. Oh, that's right. Green bean casserole. Its own suppressor. Had some of that too. Looks like you had However, some of that the suppressor as well will deteriorate there. every time you fire. Once its durability reaches zero, the noise suppression effect will be gone. So don't get too trigger happy with it. The suppressor's durability is shown in the icon. Any weapons and equipment beyond what you're carrying now, wow. you'll have to find as you go. I have to find my own weapons and equipment. Whose crazy idea was this, anyway? Solo covert actions are standard Fox operating procedure. You can't leave any traces of your presence. No weapons, equipment, footprints, sweat, or no, bodily dude, I just talk comment. I saw the same it. goes for bullets and cartridges, too. Your it's presence really in enemy dude. territory is already a violation of international conventions. I did that. I tapped that, Demon. There I tapped that. There aren't to be any American soldiers in <laughs> Russia. It could spark an international incident. Sausage. Y'all sausage. Can't let anyone see you. Oh, man. You can't let the enemy know you're there. This is a stealth mission. Sneaking you're a ghost in. snake in every sense of the word. I'm a sneaky no snake. I'm a snake. The military and U.S. government snake. will deny any involvement in the affair. Then I'll just have to take care of myself, huh? I'm afraid so. You've been given a fake death pill for that purpose. SIS guidelines stipulate that soldiers yeah. on covert Every ops Thanksgiving, like this one any, uh, issued a potassium cyanide capsule. Subs, Tape it to your body so you can take it hips, when you need to. Super chat, that would go towards the end fate if you wanted to vote for that. Use it if you're taken prisoner on the top by the right enemy. there. It'll send you into a state of false death for a short time. Fooling them into thinking that I'm really dead. So how Ooh, do I come demon, back that to sounds life? good. Just take the revival pill. They gotta work tomorrow. You mean that thing they put in my the... tooth before the mission? That's the one. But be careful. If you remain yeah, in a state Andrew, of false death for too long, <laughs> nothing will <laughs> be able to bring you back. Remember that. I'll keep it in mind. You said this was a solo mission, right? Right. I guess that means I can't count on any reinforcements. Correct. The mission rests entirely in your hands. A My real one-man army. Relax. There's a support team ready to back you up over the radio. It does <laughs> suck to suck. I'll Who introduce them to is? you. This time... Survival is of utmost is. importance. The first member of the support team will be in charge of monitoring your physical condition, acting as a medic, so to speak. That's awesome, Andrew. As well as recording when your you mission data. When you go back to data. work, Andrew, you off all weekend? She's a member of Fox as well, and she's here on the gunship with me. She? Hello, Snake. I'm paramedic. Nice to meet you. Paramedic. As in a medic who comes in by parachute. Aren't you going to tell me your real name? Are you going to tell me yours, Mr. Snake? My name, huh? It's... John Doe. And they call you Jack for short. You're a regular Captain Nemo. A name means nothing on the battlefield. Hi, Sandra. Right, I'll no go back name. to work tomorrow. What's your no, name? I'm off on the weekend. Jane Doe. So. Very funny. I wasn't. Demon, joking, have you ever seen this game before? You or is this your first time? I managed to make it back alive. My frequency is 145.73. She's also in charge of recording your mission data. Whenever you want to save, send a message over the reserved save frequency, 140.96. So saving lets me record my mission data. That's right. It also records the state of your health. Yeah. Good to know. There's one more person I want to introduce you to, Snake. Huh? Speaking of snakes, you remember the boss, don't you? A legendary soldier and your mentor. Actually, it was the boss that got the DCI's authorization in the first place. Yeah, you're. She's going to be serving as mission, Fox's mission data. advisor. The boss is. She also helped me plan this mission. She and I were at SAS together. Who dares? Jack, wins. is that you? Wait, How many years has it been? Boss. That's right. It's me. Maybe I can't remember. <sighs> Talk to me. Let me hear your voice. It's been five years, seventy-two days, and eighteen hours. You've lost weight. You can tell yep. just by the sound of my voice. Of course I can. I know all about you. special love service. Really? Well, I don't know anything about you. 
What's that supposed to mean? Why'd you disappear on me all of a sudden? I was on a top well, about 25 mission. minutes. Hmm. You didn't need I me. I remember what I asked. But there were still so many things I wanted you to teach me. No, I taught you everything you needed to know about fighting techniques. I taught you all I could. The rest you needed to learn on your own. Techniques, sure. But what about how to think like a soldier? How to think like a soldier? I can't teach you that. Andrew, we're here for a you, A soldier buddy. needs to be strong in spirit, body, and technique. And the only thing you can oh, learn okay. from someone else is technique. In fact, technique doesn't even matter. What's most important is spirit. Spirit and body are like two sides of a single coin. Wink, so They're wink, wink, nudge, thing. nudge. Happy Thanksgiving. I can't That's teach right. You how to think. You'll just have to figure it out for yourself. Listen to me, Jack. Just because soldiers are on the same side right now doesn't mean they always will be. Having personal feelings about Poor your Andrew, comrades about is one of the worst sins you can commit. Politics determine who you <laughs> face on the battlefield. And politics are a living thing. They change along with the times. Yesterday's good might be tomorrow's evil. Is that why you abandoned you've me? You've been talking about the no, boss that way, Demon. No, it had nothing to do with you. I already Fire. told you, Jack. I was on a top secret mission. A soldier has to follow whatever orders he's given. It's not his place to question why. But you're looking for a reason to fight. You're well. a natural born fighter. But you're not quite a soldier. A soldier is a political tool, nothing more. That's doubly true if he's a career soldier. Right and wrong have no place in his mission. He has no enemies and no friends. Only the mission. You follow the orders you're given. Happy turkey day, That's what being a soldier is. I do whatever I have to to get the job done. I don't think about politics. That's not the same thing. Sooner or later, your conscience is going to bother you. In the end, you have to choose whether you're going to live as a soldier or just another man with a gun. There's a saying in the Orient, loyalty to the end. Do you know what it means? Being patriotic. It means devoting yourself to your country. I follow the president and the top brass. I'm ready to die for them if necessary. The president and the top brass won't be there forever. Once their terms are up, others will take their place. That's right. I follow the will of the leader. No matter who's in charge. People aren't the ones who dictate the missions. The times. Then who does? The times. People's values change the over times. time. New York and so Times. Do the leaders of a country. <laughs> what? So there's no such thing as an enemy in absolute terms. The enemies we fight I've are only enemies in relative video. terms, constantly changing with the times. As long as we have loyalty to the end, there's no point in believing in anything, even in those we love. And that's the way a soldier's supposed to think. The only thing we can believe in with absolute certainty is the mission, Jack. All right, but do me a favor. What is it? Call me Snake. Snake? Oh, right. Your code name is Snake. It suits you well. Thank you. That's right. It. The legendary unit that the boss put together during World War II was a snake. The Cobra unit. A group of heroes that brought Love the war to music. an end and saved the world. As long as you've got a legendary hero backing you up, you'll be fine. Isn't that right, Snake? That's right. Yeah. I can't think of anyone else I'd rather have with me. Oh, and one more thing, boss. Yes? It's good to hear your voice again. Same here. After all, who knows if either of us will make it out alive. Snake, you are always best at urban warfare and infiltrating buildings. But this is the like jungle. Your son. Survival Solid is going snake. to be key. Those CQC techniques I taught you are sure to come in handy. CQC? Close quarters combat, huh? I've been in the Green Berets for the past few years. I'm probably pretty rusty. Not to worry. I'll be here to help you remember. Press the circle button After all, this is your first your enemy. actual survival mission. Pow, pow, pow. I'll be supporting you over the radio. Where are you, boss? Next to the major? The boss is communicating with us by radio from aboard a permit class submarine. In Thanks the everybody for hanging out with me on this Thanksgiving. Love you guys. Appreciate y'all. Call me if you need my advice on battle techniques. Got it. Gotcha. Your mission is to retrieve Dr. Sokolov. Dr. Sokolov is being held in an abandoned factory located to the north of your current position. Can we tuxedo this boy? Avoid heavy boy? combat and don't let anyone see you. Don't forget that this is a stealth mission.
Stealth mission with my tuxedo. Think. Try to remember some of the basics of CQC. We'll call the boss. Put that tuxedo on, call the boss. What the hell's wrong with you? Don't you what's up me? The trigger Lance discipline. Virtuous mission now. All right. Get that, let's get that tuxedo on, y'all. All right, boss. Camouflage. Visibility. Oh, come on. You can only... Snake. Here we go. What's up, boss? What's up? Don't you what's up me. Just what do you think you're doing? Hey, King Kachi. What, what do I mean? What is that camouflage you're wearing? Oh, this. What do you think? Of all the... Looks pretty good on me, doesn't it? Are you out of your mind? You can't wear that in battle. It's like saying to the enemy, Hey, here I am. Shoot me. Well, I'll admit it is a little on the flashy side. Then why don't you... But it does look good on me, doesn't it? You don't think so? Listen, wise ass. <laughs> Camouflage isn't going to do jack if it doesn't help you blend in with your surroundings. Well, I think it looks good on me. Fine. Wear whatever you want. Thought you'd like it. You'd like it. <laughs> you haven't seen that, Link? <laughs> it's hilarious. Watch this. Don't you what's up me? All right, watch this. Now we'll do the naked one. <laughs> Snake, did you take off your uniform? Yeah. What's the matter? Just needed to loosen up. <sighs> I know there's a naked option under uniform in the camouflage window that lets you take off your uniform. But without a uniform on, your camo index will remain low, and you'll burn through your stamina more quickly. So stop acting like a fool and put some camouflage on now! <sighs> Did you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's, let's put the tuxedo on. <laughs> oh yeah, definitely classic. Oh yeah. Listen up, why is it? Thought you'd like it. Oh, yeah. Oh, King Kachi, he's doing great. Thank you. He's doing amazing. Now, how's your family doing? How's, and hope you had a good Thanksgiving. If you were celebrating that. Happy Turkey Day! Gobble, gobble! Gobble, gobble. Oh, man, I'm looking good. I'm looking real good. Yeah. Major, I've spotted two enemy soldiers. They haven't spotted me yet in my flashy suit. Sent to guard Sokolov. AK-47s and grenades. 556ers and pineapples. Oh, uh, which, which football game? Snake, your presence in Soviet territory is already a violation of international about law. college, I know Ole Miss Can't and... Can't uh, find out that the CIA and the American government are involved. State plan. Contact with the enemy is strictly prohibited. Don't engage them in battle either. This is a stealth mission. Got that? The major is right. up 17 to The six. point okay. of this mission is to the sneak through the jungle okay. without so being seen. 
The success of the mission depends on how well you use your camouflage. Yeah, King Kachi, I saw that. Change your camouflage by selecting Camouflage from the Survival Viewer. The Uniform option lets you pick your uniform, while the Face option lets you change your face paint. Choosing no, it was 36 to 33, I think. Yeah, it was 36 to 33. More effectively. So that's an OT. Also, don't forget There's that anything that the end moves will stand out in the jungle. If you just stand up and run around like an idiot, you're bound to be spotted. We're gonna find. We're gonna test that theory instead, with this tuxedo. You should be able to sneak by without being noticed. Can I knock them out before they see me? We're gonna find out. You can see how effective your camouflage is by looking at the camo index. The camo index shows how well your current camouflage blends in with the surrounding area. <laughs> King Gachi, I guess. The higher the value, I mean, I the like the cowboys, but I don't. And vice versa. I have I had a good day or not on them. The key they're not is to worth make it anymore to me. With nature. Keep that in mind as you go along, okay? I would have wanted them to win, though, but they didn't. James Pond. Hey! What up, Shade? James Pond. I love it. What's up with you, Shawnee? Good to see you, dude. Happy Turkey Day. Happy Thanksgiving. Go! Cool. Sneaking in with my tuxedo. My tuxedo. Thank y'all for being here. Thanks for the support. And Andrew, that fog sound badge looks good next to you, baby. Oh, yeah. Johnny, had it. it was good. I had a good one. It was good. Got him, son. That like. Get him. Bato, bato. Bato, bato. Let's eat some. I see you caught yourself a reticulated python. Oh yeah, I did. The reticulated python is said to be the longest snake in the world. Oh. The biggest ones can grow up to 10 meters in length. Although they're not poisonous, they're still very dangerous, so be careful around them. They have a highly ferocious temperament, and they can swallow whole to hear that, large Pope. animals like deer and pigs. Their most distinguishing feature is the mesh pattern of their scales. This pattern acts as a highly effective natural camouflage. If you think there might be Ooh, a reticulated nice, python about, pay close <sighs> attention to your surroundings. Otherwise, you could get bitten before you even know it's there. It's a huge snake, but you should be able to capture it alive by using the tranquilizer gun. I'll bet if you capture one and throw it at an enemy, it'll give him a good scare. You've eaten one, haven't you? Yeah. yeah. It wasn't half bad. Cannibal. What was that? Nothing. Talk to you later. <laughs> Cannibal. Happy Thanksgiving, Luna. Good to see you. Going in. Roger that. Major, 
I've reached the abandoned factory where Sokolov is supposedly being held. This place is a dump. I can't see Sokolov from here. The security is pretty tight. There are sentries posted around the perimeter. I wonder how many are inside. Enough. Your objective, Sokolov, is inside the factory. They should be holding him in a room in the northeast section. Northeast section. Got it. Northeast. It's like top be right, careful. right, right. Your mission is to bring Sokolov back alive. Happy Thanksgiving. You Hope you are doing well. must not be exposed to any kind of danger. What well, was everyone's favorite dish Sokolov to have today if anybody had effect. some Thanksgiving right. meals? Oh, and one more thing, Snake. You mean there's more? It's like mashed potatoes no, for Shawnee. No, it's just that when you get to Sokolov, I want you to tell him something from me. And that is? Sorry for being so late. Is that all? Yes. Understood. Beginning my approach to the target. Mm. Sounds good, Sean. How did that turn out? Chat. Okay. Try again. Oh, po. Oh, I see. Who's that? Nobody. Close. Just in case. All right. Got it with the tuxedo. Ooh. Get a lot of mac and cheese. All right, coming in with that tux. Looking good. It's them. But you. Are you one of Vulcan's men? You must be suck a duck. I mean, so I mean, suck a duck. Me. Whatever your name is. I'm a CIA agent. I've come to escort you back to the other side of the Iron Curtain. Your CIA? Yeah. I was sent by Major Zero, the man who got you out two years ago. Zero? I have a message from him. What is it? He said to tell you sorry. I'm a CIA so agent named John Glue instead of James Bond. John Glue. Did he now? What does it mean? It means he's a man of his word. But we've got no time for this. You have to get me out of here before they arrive. Yeah, right, Andrew. Who's they? Colonel Vulgan of Gru. Vulgan? You in the West know what a bastard. Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt? Never heard of him. He's a member of the army's extremist faction, a man who seeks to seize control of the motherland. Ever since the Cuban Missile Crisis two years ago, Khrushchev has been pursuing a policy of peaceful coexistence with the West. The West. Despite resistance and criticism from hawks in the army and the provincial authorities, Khrushchev has managed to suppress the opposition so far, but the failure of his agricultural policies has put him in a precarious position. And on top of that, the tragedy last November. President Kennedy's assassination. Precisely. 
In a sense, Khrushchev has lost his biggest partner and his power base is rapidly crumbling away. A certain group is plotting to use this opportunity to seize power by rallying the anti-government forces, overthrowing Khrushchev, and installing Brezhnev and Kosygin in his place. The mastermind behind this plot is Colonel Volgin of the Gru. He has control over another secret weapons research facility much like this one, OKB-812, known as the Granin Design Bureau, and is using it to further his plans. But that is You're not going, enough no, to not today. Him. European, now they're much crazier than we are. The weapon I have been developing here and use it as leverage in his bid for power. How are you, Link? Well, you've done a lot of the games then if you're if, at that point. The intelligence says that they are going to make them. Is it really the buffering for anyone the else? Test. Then I'm not losing any frames or anything, so it must be on YouTube's end. Sorry, y'all. Exactly. They wouldn't need that many men just that to light keep button, me inside. Hit that light. Please, Their please. Their orders were to prevent Colonel Volgin from capturing me. Even if it meant killing me in the process, or so it would seem. Volgin will come. I'm sure of it. You must get me out of here before then. Leave it to me. By the way, your Russian is superb. Oh, thank you. Where did you learn to speak it? From my mentor. Hey, Migdia, what's up, buddy? Is that so? America is truly a frightening country. Having second thoughts? No. I have no love for this place. Let's go. So it's not just my channel, it's other channels too. Okay. Major, this is Snake. Sokolov is safe with me. He's doing fine. No injuries. Good work, Snake. Now hurry up and get Sokolov to the recovery point. Glad to hear that, Link. with you there. Roger. What about the sentries? I managed to get past them. I see. What about the boss? We lost contact with the boss some time ago. What happened? It's probably just a weak signal. Just hurry and get Sokolov out of there. Johnny, that's weird. I mean, since a lot of people are off there watching YouTube and they can't handle the graphic, who knows? Dang, YouTube, where's my raid function? Where's the gifted memberships? What else they were planning on doing? <laughs> Asworth, happy Thanksgiving. How are you doing? Glad to hear you. I hope you had a good one. Good to see you, Madsworth. So this is the legendary boss. Huh? Huh? We meet at last. You! You're from the Oslo. Dang, Andrew, that sucks. That's nice. Huh? What's a crew soldier doing here? Bro. Get out of the way so he, before he shoots me. Soldier? He's the Ocelot commander. 
That's Major Ocelot to you. And don't you forget it. Sokolov is ours. Now get out of here. And Ocelot never lets his prey escape. What? Hey, you are slow. Nice job not firing even a single shot. Y'all suck. I can't say it feels good to kill a comrade, even if it is for the Gru. Sokolov, take cover. Huh. You're not the boss, are you? Tony, I guess that's what it was. What is that stance? Huh. That gun. <laughs> if you're not the boss, then die. A dud! The other one. Hey, Mama Nita. Happy Thanksgiving, Mama Nita. Good to see you. Possible. You ejected the first bullet by hand, didn't you? I see what you were trying to do. But testing a technique you've only heard about in the middle of battle wasn't very smart. You were asking to have your gun jam on you, huh? Besides, I don't think you're cut out for an automatic in the first place. You tend to twist your elbow to absorb the recoil. That's more of a revolver technique. You filthy American dog! <laughs> 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 But that was some fancy shooting. You're pretty good. <sighs> pretty good. You eat yoga pants? Hey, well, I am a mad lad. Good to see you, yoga pants. How are you?
Yeah, I'm mad. <laughs> At least for now. Major, do you read me? I read you. Snake, you all right? Thanks, Predator. I appreciate it, snags. buddy. These guys were after Sokolov, too. Apparently, they were taking orders from a Gru colonel named Volgan. Volgan? Gru colonel? Part of an internal Soviet power struggle, according to Sokolov. Something between the KGB and Gru. Between Khrushchev's supporters and Volgan's. Sokolov was being guarded by the KGB and hunted by Gru? Snake, it sounds like this could be even hotter than Cuba. I don't like it. Something about the whole thing stinks. I agree. You better hurry. Cold for far so too long. Wait, MGS team, my bad. But I'll catch up to him. All right, Mama. We're Lita. counting on you. Glad to get to get a little time off. That's good. That's real good. Go to sleep. Sokolov, take cover. I don't think I can even get anything in here, can I? Until after we come back. Somebody else around, I just want to... I know I'm supposed to backtrack. Oh, nothing. All right, here we go. Go here we go. Here we go now. At the raw with me. Oh, the raw with me. Oh, the raw with me. The raw with me. I'm just got to give. Here we go. We'll be getting the theme song here pretty soon. Don't you get too excited, y'all. Okay. Happy Thanksgiving again to you. From the awesome I eat yoga pants. Yes. Thanks for stopping in and hanging out the with us today. The best crew has to offer. They're coming for me. I'm finished. Calm down. I'll get you out of here, I promise. And we've got some of the best backup we could ask for. Look. That's what they were making you build. Yes. Oh, yeah. The Shagahod. Shagadelic. Like behemoth, baby. A tank capable of launching nuclear IRBM. It can launch nuclear missiles from that kind of terrain. That was my cap for those I don't know. And without support from friendly units. A nuclear equipped tank capable of operating solo. Big tank. Is that thing finished? No. This is only the end of phase one. It won't be truly finished until we complete. Phase two. Phase two. The weapon's true form. If it is completed and the Colonel gets his hands on it, it will mean the end of the Cold War. It'll the end of hot, the Cold War. War. Yes. Predator again, thanks and for life. The leave me a like. Will truly begin. A world war. I had no choice but to cooperate. I didn't want to die. I wanted to see my wife and child again in America. Please, take me to America. Quickly! Working on it. They cannot complete it without my help. Got it. Let's go. The 
the warm war. <laughs> Not specific enough, the United States of America. What would I have if you would just shot her in the head? Go to sleep, boss. Oh, Andrew, you know he can't wait. Can't wait at all for that. Hey, Lori Allen, known as the boss, what's up? Hey! That's not nice. Stop it! What are you doing? Good work, Jack. What are you doing here? Sokolov comes with me. Champ, welcome in. Andrew, I don't know. It's supernatural. Like, we don't My really friends. know. Maybe Let us fight it's fart. I have not controls them. Who knows? Day. I don't know. <laughs> we will fight with you once more. Welcome back, boss. Now that all five all of us are together, it's time we Maybe go to the depths of hell itself. Yeah, who knows? Pheromones, maybe someone, I don't it's know. It's raining blood. Not specific enough to control specifically where he wanted to go, but... Is he crying? There he is! Yeah, oh, he's crying all right. Tears of blood, because you killed him! There he goes. Oh my gosh, Andrew. Like earlier this year, was in February? Kuabara, Kuabara. Hey, Mama Nita, what does that mean? Google it. <laughs> Is that Mama Nita and I first got to know each other right here? Never right, Mama oh, Nita. What a joyful scene. Google it, Colonel Vogan. Welcome to my country and to my unit. Boss, what is this? I'm defecting to the Soviet Union. Sokolov is a little gift for my new hosts. Recoilless nuclear warheads. Project Gangster Metal Gear Ninja Mama need it. <laughs> These will make a fine gift for me. This can't be happening. Who is he? Another one of your disciples? That's right. Don't be a dick, Mama Nita. Hey, fine. I won't watch you ever again. I'm like, oh, don't, don't leave me, no, Mama Nita, please, this one is don't go. Just a child, too pure for us cobras. Please, don't. He has go. not yet found an emotion to carry into battle. What are you talking about? My emotion about? is pissed off. Think you can pull the trigger? Well, I can't pull the trigger now. Ow. 
Ow! That hurts. Good memories, that's right. Kind of bad, but good. Face. Great now. We can't let him live. If Khrushchev mm. finds out about this, we're finished. <sighs> Die. Wait. He's my apprentice. I'll take care but of him. But great now. <clears throat> Jack? Ryan's like, yeah, I got this. pissed on. <laughs> but now it's all love. That's right. You show me the error of my ways, Mama Nita. I'd be a better streamer, better inter interactive entertainer. here now onto Sokolov's research facility Shagohad is ours drift away my place is with them now Snake, can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. Just barely. Snake, listen to me. You need emergency medical treatment. Can you move? Johnny, that's right. You've got to get those wounds that's treated. Versatile. Hang in there. All right, let's get you fixed up. Paramedic? Okay, Snake. Just relax and it'll all be over before you know it. Good to know. Stay with me. I've seen people in worse shape before. Think you can handle it? No. Major. The boss. She's defected. We'll talk about that later. First, we've got to get you patched up. Okay, here we go. First, open the survival viewer with the start button. Got it. If you select cure, you can start the treatment. Good. Healing is divided into treatment using medicine with the item window button and surgical treatment using the weapon window button. Your injuries include a fractured left elbow and rib bone and lacerations on your upper arms, right elbow and abdomen. They need to be fixed using surgical treatment. Oh my goodness. Move the healing cursor with the left stick to the affected part of your body. Once you've selected the affected area, hold the weapon window button and use the left stick to select the medical item and then press the inner button. With this method, you can use items to help your recovery process. To treat a bone fracture, first secure the affected area with a fastener and then wrap it in bandages. That should do it. Got it. For lacerations, you'll need disinfectant to clean the wound, sutures to stitch it up, 
styptic to slow the flow of blood, and bandages to wrap the wound. Got it. If you do everything I mentioned, the wound should heal completely. Good to know. Understood? Sure. Yeah. Stay with me. Go into the survival viewer and treat those wounds. Let's treat those wounds. First, we're going to talk to you about something. All right, so. You're seeing this for the first time. Look right there. Sorrow's body's right here. That's why you see him when you're in the river. Right there. That's Cesaro's body. The boss killed him. He gave his life for her and said, You kill me. I want you to live. There it is, the sorrow. There he is. Because I didn't know. You can also look at it at this view. Look out like that. Can't see it, but up bottom left, you can see his body as well. If you had the old camera view, there he is. Cesaro. Boom. There it is. Boop, there it is. Mm. Boop, there it is. Boop, there it is. Boop, there it is. Yeah. Pretty cool, huh? That's cool. Nice, Andrew. All right. Cure. Could have been Leon. Anybody seen the Resident Evil movie yet? I've heard mostly mixed, but mostly not a, not very good reviews on it. But I haven't like read like synopsis or anything of it. From what I understand, they've tried to do too much and little, too many things and. Couple hours. Now they were doing RE1 and RE2 kind of combined together, and I was like, yeah, that didn't sound like a good idea. I haven't seen the movie, so I don't know. Andrew, have you seen it? It's so hard for me with my responsibilities with being good job, job a wife, kids, We're coming to get stuff you like now. that. It's so Just hard for me to go to the movies we'll right now. Balloon. Can you set it up? You can also see him here too. Boom, there he is. There's a sorrow. So sorrow. Yeah, right, buddy. Let's see you. I'm gonna need a five dollar holla for early. Appreciate you. Thank you so much. Give it up to Mama Nita in the chat. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> thank you.
<laughs> I feel you on that. Excellent. A great success. Thanks to the boss and her cobras, I have both Sokolov and the Shagohad. I swear I didn't do it. I didn't fart. What are we going to do with the girl? Who is she? Apparently she's Sokolov's woman. Fast, my dear. A kiss of death. Are you KGB? We may be able to use her. Take her back to the base. Oh, you, you've seen That's the movie Demon, you, you enjoyed it. Well, that's cool. We have no further use for Sokolov's research. What did you like? Like I said, I haven't seen it yet. So. I think it's time I gave this marvelous new toy what? a try. Colonel, even if they are our enemies, they're still our countrymen. But it won't be me that pulled the trigger. It'll be our friend, the American defector. You're going to nuke your fellow Russians? <laughs> the Alamo. Colonel! So yeah, okay. I, I was gonna say, I'll probably like it, but again... They're trying to do too much. We'll I just had to watch it. Save it. Darkness and silence through the night. What a thrill. Andrew, what do you say on that one? Yeah, Mom, I don't think I would either. But you don't have... Uh, you're not naked. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Enjoy this amazing song. I don't want to ruin it. So, Happy Thanksgiving! My gift to you is to not sing over it. You're welcome. Silence through the night What a thrill I'm searching and I'll melt into you What a fear in my heart But you're so supreme
tree frog. It's so deep the trial to survive. Amazing song. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. Yeah, it's not out yet. Moment. Hey, Andre, what's up? Happy Thanksgiving. What's up, Andre? Currently flying over the Arctic Ocean, altitude 30,000 feet, approaching Soviet airspace. Arriving at the designated drone launch point. Drone oil pressure and voltage are nominal. Payload oxygen supply is nominal. Nominal. Power supply to payload any three systems shows no problems. No gusts. All systems go for drone detachment. Snake, we can't risk a halo. How was your day, Andre? Airspace security has gotten tighter since we were last here. We can't get as close to the ground as we did during the Virtuous mission. So instead, we'll be using one of our newest weapons. Snake, you're being given an honor on par with Alan Shepard. This is our last chance. Show your patriotism. If you fail, you'll be back in a hospital bed again, waiting for the firing squad. That's not nice. So how does it feel to be a patient in one of the most advanced ICUs in the world? Would you do me a favor and tell the suits about visiting hours? I'll never get better with them assaulting me day and night with their questions. Must be part of the top brass's inquiry. More like an interrogation. According to them, I'm a traitor and an accomplice to the boss's defection. They're just looking for a scapegoat. Does that mean they're after you too? Hmm. Let's just say neither one of us is going to be made a national hero out of this. Does this mean Fox is going to die? No. This Fox is still one step ahead of the hounds. The reason I came to see you today, Jack, it's time for Fox to clear its name. What are you talking about? Oh, Andre, sounds good, buddy. Has changed. We still got a chance to come out of this one alive. Yeah, what kind of chance? Don't get too excited. I love the new bomb movie. We liked it. Was yeah. good. I mean, a cigar. it's definitely not my favorite. I thought it was a good like movie, but this morning. I know. I don't want to say anything because I don't want to spoil anything. They decided when they're going to execute us. No. Something even bigger. Yesterday, the White House received an unexpected Didn't have the typical Bond charm type of it but movie, but it was still, I still enjoyed the movie, though. Yes, I hear you, Mr. Chairman. But... I feel like... It was a hotline call from... Chris yeah, President it was. Like, I, w I didn't see that, that they were going to do that. I was like... A few days ago, one of That's definitely something they've never done in any Bond movie. Okay, I'll just say that. I was kind of like... Was destroyed okay, then. ...nuclear explosion. At about the same time, our anti-aircraft radar picked up a signature that appeared to come from one of your military aircraft. Does any of this sound familiar to you? In retaliation, I have placed our armed forces on secondary alert. Depending on your response, I may be left with no choice but to order the military to maximum alert and unleash Armageddon. With the help of your predecessor, I was able to survive the Cuban incident. But my power 
is not as great as it once was. If I am to survive this crisis, I must have your full cooperation. I Speaking of Uncharted, that's myself. Sully's Did voice actor right there from Uncharted. To your country a week ago? No. Speaking of it. So you haven't heard that. The man who arranged Victor Josh the Dang was a right our... colonel by the name of Yevgeny Borosovich Volgin. Volgin? Of the Brezhnev faction. Go on. Who is the soldier? Her name is the boss. She's a living legend. During World War II, she was the one who led us to victory in that war. In Russia, you know her as Voyevoda. You mean the boss? The mother of your special forces? Yes, that's the one. And she took two miniature nuclear shells along with her. The boss took two miniature nuclear shells? I'm afraid so. I believe they were a gift for her new hosts. The Davy Crockett <laughs> atomic and, and and delivery didn't know system that. was completed two Which years ago. Which one? Serious problems were found with the launcher's range and precision. Although they were mass-produced, they've never been deployed in battle. But Sokolov's research facility was completely wiped out. The whole area is polluted. I can only offer you my deepest condolences over this terrible tragedy. So, the boss, with Colonel Volgen's help, stole two experimental nuclear shells and took them with her as gift when she defected. Then, shortly thereafter, Sokolov's design lab, a top secret military research facility, was destroyed by one of these weapons. Am I right so far? Yes, that's correct. And the American government denies any involvement in the affair. Is that right as well? Andrew, I know that would have been hilarious. We're not involved in any way. <laughs> then what was a U.S. military aircraft doing on our radar screen? It was clearly in violation of our airspace. And yet you say it was not acting under your orders. That's correct. You expect me to believe that this was all the work of a single soldier? I don't know what else to tell you. The army insists that this is all a ploy on your part. I've said it once and I'll say it again. Our government had nothing to do with it. And I would like dearly to believe you. However, I'm afraid my power over the military has weakened since the Cuban incident. I will need some kind of proof that this was not the action of the American government. You have one week. You must catch the boss yourselves and recover the remaining nuclear device. Then, you must find some way to prove your innocence. Prove our innocence? Yes, preferably something painful prove to me that this is not merely another one of your tricks the boss should be close to colonel volgan how about a little co-action i would not expect too much if i were you the political situation here is unstable and colonel volgan is a member of the brezhnev faction which seeks to topple my government one week you have only one week, and if it is not too much to ask, do something about Volgen as well. What is that supposed to mean? Nothing. It means nothing. Call it a modest gentleman's agreement to ensure our continued relationship. What if we can't prove our innocence? Then I will be unable to restrain the military. I will be ousted, and they will seek their revenge. A nuclear attack on the United States? I leave the disposal of this situation entirely to your discretion, Mr. President. Disposal? If you fail, it will mean the beginning of a new world war. To put it simply, in order to avoid a full-scale nuclear conflict, we have to prove that America was not involved in that explosion. And eliminating the boss ourselves will prove America's innocence? Right. The higher-ups have decided that you're the only one capable of pulling this off. You were her last apprentice, 
Screw this one up, and we'll both be six feet under. There's no choice. Are the yeah. Russians going to be helping us? The KGB has promised to lend us one of their communications satellites so that you and I can talk. To a double O means that they have been, it. been. They've also put us in touch with the government. They earned inside. that code, Insiders. the double O code. There was a They're defection the in books, September 1960. Maybe in ca Casino Royale in the you movie, the maybe they talk about it. In Casino Royale, I think you have to Soviet kill Union. at least Precisely. one person. Since then, they've apparently been training with the KGB. No, exactly he's this killed. kind of situation. Their code names are Adam and a mission, and you've had at least I've been told that kill. Adam's you can get a double O code right. name. Also yeah, I can, arrange for I can, him to provide you with an escape route. Other ones like double O six. You'll need to rendezvous with him when you get there. We got that one in. Uh, It's two kills. Okay, two kills from double O's status. Control. Two kills. That's right. Aircraft two kills. Altitude thirty thousand feet. Okay, okay, two kills. That's not right. Two kills from double O status. So in order to get that number, estimated airspeed exceeding Mach three. Kills. Kills. Bearing south. I'm about to lose it. In the book, that's what they talk about. And I can't remember the Casino Royale often say that too, but I know in the books they said two kills. I think that's right. And it's double O, it's not zero, zero, seven. In the books, in the books originally, it's zero, zero, seven. Sorry, sorry, excuse me. O, O, seven. Not zero, zero, seven. It's actually originally the letter O and letter O and then seven. And they changed the letter, I think. For whatever reason, the actual numbers zero zero seven. Originally, it was like <laughs> which my Twitch name since since double O seven was taken, I did zero zero the X or. Since 007 was taken, I did 007, and, it, and, I, and it's on there, so I could use it, so. Hey, to focus, what's up, buddy? Happy Thanksgiving, brother. Thankful for you. Thankful for you. This is Snake. Do you read me? Loud and clear. Glad to see you landed safely. I got blown pretty far off target. Mm -hmm. Snake. Let's go over your mission objectives one more time. Rescue Sokolov. Find out what's happened to the Shagahod, then destroy it. And finally, eliminate the boss. Eliminate the boss. Eliminator. This mission will be codenamed Operation Snake Eater. Three pounds of shrimp, damn to focus. Unit, right? Don't Good forget Lord. about Colonel Volkin. I'm not a hired killer. I know, but that was the Kremlin's demand. Demand? You mean it wasn't just a request? What's it to us if Phoenix, the Khrushchev enjoy the turkey. How about you? Colonel and his faction. If supporting the current regime turkey helps to support eater. a nuclear exchange, then yeah. that's what we'll do. And what are the CIA's demands? Our priorities are the rescue of Sokolov and the destruction of the Shagahod. Right. Talking about that since I watched the latest Hold on, here Snake. recently. What now? I'm changing my code name. It turns out Tom wasn't the most auspicious choice. What do you mean? Well, the truth is, when I chose my code name, I picked the wrong one. The wrong one? Did you ever see the movie The Great Escape? It came out last year. Because I enjoyed it. It, was, it wasn't my favorite. Anyway, I did enjoy watching it. About prisoners who escaped but the POW it's not, it's not one I want to go back and prisoners watch over and over again. Like Casino Royale. But the Nazis find two of the tunnels and then before they finish. Those are probably my top two from, tunnel. from Craig. The names of those three tunnels were Dick, but Harry, and I think Casino Royale is still my favorite. The first one is still you my favorite. You the name of the tunnel they escaped in as your code name because you thought it would bring you good luck. Yes, that's exactly right. At least, that was the plan. But? But I got the name wrong. The one they escaped in was Harry. Tom was one I of the unlucky the tunnels. It was discovered by the Nazis before Skyfall. it was finished. I He's watched your favorite movie, movie of all time? Sure. That's cool. In fact, I even yeah, ordered I like the actual Royale film from the movie company. 
Yeah, it doesn't sound well, like Those are both my top two use. for uh, Craig. So what should I call you? Hmm. You know, let's just use Zero, like we've been doing all along. Oh, nah, such a all right, then. campy movie. Major Zero it is. <laughs> we'll start over from square one. From square zero. My frequency is 140.85. Oh, I almost forgot. Paramedic is with us again on this mission. Is this her Jacob, last happy Thanksgiving to you too, sir. If we fail, she'll have her medical license revoked. That is a More great More or less plot. the same kind of fate. Her frequency is the same as during the virtuous mission. 145.73. She'll be recording your mission data as well, just like the last time. That frequency is also the same. 140.96. And there's one more person on your support team. His name is Mr. Sigint. He's an expert on the latest in weapons and equipment technology. You'll be going up against some of the world's most advanced weaponry when you infiltrate the research facility. If you have any questions, just ask him. Hello, Ice. How are you? Frequency is one four eight. Happy Thanksgiving. Point four one. Mr. Sigint, got it. Adam, your KGB Mama, contact, Nina, not even is a full waiting one? for you at the abandoned all? factory wow. up ahead. The same factory was being held in last week. Yes, meet up with Adam first. He's cleared the way for you to rescue Sokolov. How will I know this Adam guy? When Over I 30 see? likes, thank you, You'll everybody. know once you reach the factory. The whole area has <laughs> been polluted by the fallout from that nuclear blast. Johnny. No one else would dare come close. He's eating the mashed potatoes. Who are the Patriots? And Lali Lule Lo. Lali Lule Lo. Gotcha. gotcha. You've been equipped. I'll with forgive a you this time, Mama this Nita. Don't let it happen careful, again. It's noisy. I thought standard Fox procedure was procure on-site weapons acquisition. The circumstances are different this time. You're now on an official mission for the United oh, the States movies. government. I'd it like would to be do necessary that sometime, to make your to presence them. known to a certain extent, to the Khrushchev regime at the very least. But remember, this is still a sneaking mission. Snake, if you fail this mission, it will mean an all-out nuclear war. Keep that in mind and proceed with extreme caution. Yeah, it. Understood. Commencing Operation Snake Eater. It sounds good. It would have you. Hey, Light Gazer, what's up? My movies were great back in the day, but culture changes. Let me catch a guy acting like that. I might be a... What? I don't know what you mean, but... Maybe just some things that they do wouldn't be acceptable today. Maybe that's what you mean. I don't know. And that might be what you mean. Oh, woo. what's up, Light Gazer? Happy, ba happy Thanksgiving. What you doing, dude? Oh, really? Give me. Oh! You avoided everyone today, okay. I see what you're saying, Light Gazer, I gotcha. Not necessarily. I don't think so, Andrew. I've read several of them now, and it's kind of hard for me to say, but he's actually... He's actually not. He's actually not as... the At least the books that I've read, are, you know, well, I say listen to so far. 
He's actually not as much of a sex crazed person as he is in the movies. He's actually a lot more like gritty, down to earth kind of guy, more so. And more about the mission more than he is in the movies. Now, there might be some things I can't even remember now that I've heard. They were like, oh, but I mean, like, I feel like there's not as much of a, an emphasis on that like they do in the movies. Like... You just heard a horse? I sure did. Yeah. You sure it wasn't something else? I know a horse when I hear one. <laughs> Paramedic, are there any wild horses in Selino Yask? Do you really expect me to say yes? No. So what should I do? He goes to space. There's only one way through that area. All you can do is move forward. Head towards the sound of that horse. It came from the north. Be careful. Oh, Lieutenant Dan. Lieutenant Dan, ask Crane. I forgot to put my tuxedo on. Hey. Oh well. It's alright. I gotta pee. Be right back. Again, they might they probably might talk about a few things here, but Andrew, it's not as much of a emphasis like they did in the movie. So I don't wanna say that it wasn't there. But I just know that I, I do know that if it was thrown at Thrown out a lot more than it was in the movies. I think I would have noticed. Looks like death wasn't. Ready. Hey, dynamic du diode. Good to see you. Happy Thanksgiving. I gotta pay. Nice. I had about about Get twenty five of them, Doctor Peppers. How's it feel to be an all American? I gotta pay. What are you pay. doing here? <laughs> oh, Defuca's no doubt. I you, if you do that, just, just imagine 50 years from now. I mean, things evolve, cultures evolve. You've got to Go. look at things through the lens of what was gone through then. But but then also appreciate where things have come from and to learn from those things, but not to completely just demonize her. every little thing. You don't have a prayer of finishing your all mission. the time you're when, you're just, when a lot of people just weren't sure. Oh, I agree. Hey, Geronimo. That's that's why Twitter. Sorry, I'm about to go pee again. That's why Twitter right now. When it first happened, and Facebook, and then today, and people using stuff. There's like forever ago. No matter what it is, go home. Is tearing go people apart. Boss. Like. There's no need to prove that it's, you are virtuous here. It's awful. Social media is divided us like great. That's why I don't like to post it. Like all my personal stuff. And like, I know I never really, I try not to post anything with like opinions. Like, I just, cause you just never know what might happen in 15, 20 years. That should stir things anyway. up a bit. You'd better hurry. The border is 60 miles south of here. You ought to be able to run that far. Why'd you defect? I didn't. I'm loyal to the end, to my purpose. What about you, Jack? What's it going to be? Loyalty to your country or loyalty to me? Your country or your old mentor? The mission or your beliefs? Your duty to your unit or your personal feelings? You don't know the truth yet. But sooner or later, you'll have to choose. Exactly, Andrew. Don't erase history. 
I don't expect you to forgive me. But you can't defeat me either. You know me too well. Just look at that bandana. If you can't put the past behind you, you won't survive long. If we meet again, I'll kill you. Now, go home. This is Snake, Major Zero. I read you, Snake. I was ambushed by the boss. You were what? The drone's been shot to hell. It's up in flames. That's not good. Enemy scouts are gonna come looking for you. Yeah, I know. But what was the boss doing here in the first place? There's gotta be a leak somewhere. No, that's impossible. The man who's such working an interesting with Vulcan isn't exactly on speaking terms with Khrushchev. I lost my gun. The boss destroyed it. Snake, I know how you're feeling. It's hard for me to believe, too, that a legendary hero like the boss would go over to the Russians. That she'd double cross us like this. Hey, Vicious, don't go is, home, you can stay. Accept it, you'll never be <laughs> you able to stay, I promise. It. That's not the problem. In terms of sheer technique, I'll never be able to beat her. I know that all too well. You've got to do it, Snake. She's oh, your no, enemy she's and your character. objective. Enemy? We were together for ten years, and now you tell me she's my enemy? Enough. Hurry to the factory where Adam is waiting. Scouts have probably already been sent out to investigate the explosion. You've lost your weapon, right? That means you've got no chance of winning in a battle situation. Whatever you do, don't let them see you. Don't let them see me, okay. Tuxedo suit. Nothing to see here. Yeah! <laughs> what the hell is this? Nothing! Nothing to see here! <laughs> I know! Exactly to focus true. Good point. I'm hoping I can... I can't seek you see. That a baby! Okay, this part's gonna be a lot harder. <laughs> Hold on. Give him the Patriot.
I can't, you can't use CQC either with the tux. Oh, God! No! <laughs> okay, I got an idea. I got an idea. I got an idea. Okay. Summer Bear! Crab Prime! Happy Thanksgiving to you too, my friend! Thank you, Gavin! Nothing, nothing. That is so awesome. Thank you so much, Summer Bear. There's nobody here. Damn it, don't turn around! <sighs> Thank you so much, dude. Baby! Yeah, I know. And then, of course, V can play in so many ways, too. Alright, I'm gonna leave and come back. Leave and come back. I tried to do this with the tuxedo. It was so damn tough. On European Extreme, I mean. Alright. Got that guy dead. That guy be that guy's dead. Nothing here, man. Nothing here. Bruh. Turn around. Knock your ass off the bridge. See if I can knock him off the bridge. Y'all want to see that? Y'all ready? Come here. Huh? <laughs> 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 
suck it. Get out, get uh uh get down Oh yeah, Mama yeah, I did know that. I did. With games is that a is that a Netflix show? T V show? I think it is, isn't it? What's up, bro? Yeah, I think I did know that. It is so dumb, though. Especially now. Hell yeah, McJuicy. Those are amazing movies. Love both of those. Miniseries, yeah. Suck it. What are you buying? Sadak with the five bits. Light Gazer both one and two. Light Gazer. He says he's playing to watch Home Alone one and two. And I said, yeah, I like both of those. Hold on just a second, Psyduck. Just a second, hold on. <laughs> no, like Azer, you're good. I was letting you know what I meant. Yeah, die hard, of course. You're suffering in Ghost Recon Wild Well, thank you for the five cents there, or the five bits. Give it up. Can't find the thing. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much, Psyduck. Right, that five bit, that five bit side. Do you want that for uh, the end of, for fight, early or old age? Which one? First Die Hard's a Christmas movie. No one argues that. Five dollar holla. Neither. I appreciate them bits. So neither. So you don't want it to go to anything. Well, fine. I won't put it towards anything. Thumb of Bear, if you don't know what Die Hard is, there's this thing called Google. Towards me being me. All right, Psyduck. I can do that. So if you don't want to go towards anything, that's fine. Thank you. There's this thing called... Oh, yeah. Mama Nita it. <laughs> right, Mama Nita, show them how it's done. Well, Summer Bear, just... We're not going to explain it. You just, just Google it. Just Google it. That's all I got to say. Dun 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 It's amazing. Yippee ki yay, mother sucker. That's Carl Watts' face. Take it. Yo! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sounds like the... 
the Davy... Snake, what are you wearing now? A uh, tuxedo? Yeah. What, you late for a wedding or something? Yeah. Come to think about it, the tuxedo is an all-black outfit. It'll probably help you blend in in a dark environment. Oh, yeah. One thing you can't do, though, is equip knife-type weapons. And you can't use CQC either. Remember that. I can't equip knife-type weapons? Are you sure about that? Um... Would you say a knife is a knife-type weapon? What do you guys think? What's up, Kaiser? I'm pretty sure that's a knife top weapon there. False. Fake news. Fake news, Sigit. Try again. The heavy machine gun, I think so too. All right, here we go. Another great one. How many? They sure did. <laughs> I just now, I just, I just now noticed that. Snake, what's up? Why are you naked? I know there's a naked option under uniform that lets you take off the upper part of your uniform. But without a shirt on, your camouflage sucks, and your stamina goes down faster. You don't get any advantages whatsoever. Sure there are. Like what? It feels good. Man, you do whatever you want. I will, thanks. Just one question, though. What? Is there a way to take off my pants? Say what? My pants, can I... Oh, hell no! This fox unit is a nut fest! <laughs> I love that one. <laughs> All right, and the cardboard box, of course. Hero, come on now. Uh, Snake, what are you doing? I'm in a box. In a box? A cardboard box? Why are you... I don't know. I was just looking at it, and suddenly I got this irresistible urge to get inside. Yeah. No. Not just an urge. More than that. It was my destiny to be here. In the box. Destiny? Yeah. And then, when I put it on, I suddenly got this feeling of inner peace. I can't put it into words. <laughs> sure, I'm telling I you. I feel safe. Like this is where I was meant to be. Like I'd found the key to true happiness. Uh-huh. Does any of that make sense? Not even a, a little. little. You should come inside the box. Then you'll know what I mean. Man, I don't want to know, know what, what you mean. mean. Between you and paramedic, is everyone but me that is hooked up with a major strange? Uh. Yeah. yeah, well, anyway, I suppose even that dumbass box might make a decent disguise if you wear it inside a building. I haven't seen Race to Witch Mountain. I gotta put that tuxedo back on, y'all. Tux run. Oh, Lingzo, there's so many. This is this one probably has the most funny. Codex in any of the games, for, by far. Like, they're hilarious. I mean, I'm trying to, at least. I'm trying. I'm trying. I'm trying to do tux only. Done it thus far. Hey, Omega. Happy Thanksgiving to you too, my friend. And Kaiser over there on Twitch. Thank you. 
sorry I'm late. Cut the engine. They'll hear us. Are you the agent they sent? The big, is that, you have a big boss? Yes, they Are did. Are you Adam? I thought you were supposed to be a man. Adam couldn't make it. All right, say the password. <laughs> Who are the Patriots? Who are the Patriots? Answer me! We're trapped. Get down! Juicy, do you really? The name's Eva. This wasn't part of the plan. What happened to Adam? What's your code name? It's Snake. Snake, huh? Well, I'm Eva. Are you here to tempt me? What happened to Adam? Colonel Volgan is a very suspicious man. He decided Adam wasn't the right person for this mission. And you were? Yes. Why? Because I can do things he can't. I heard you used to be a codebreaker for the NSA. I was. Four years ago, I defected to the Soviet Union with Adam. Mauser military. The broom handle. It packs quite a punch. Nice to have when you're on a bike. You held it sideways and used the muzzle jump to create a horizontal sweep. That was impressive. Bet you've never seen that technique in the West. It's imitation, isn't it? Yeah. It's a Chinese Type 17 pistol. Around here, even that's hard to come by. Don't worry, though. The one I've got for you is American-made. Forty-five, huh? Hmm. Incredible. Do you like it? The feeding ramp is polished to a mirror sheen. The slide's been reinforced. And the interlock with the frame is tightened for added precision. The sight system is original, too. The thumb safety is extended to make it easier on the finger. A long type trigger with non slip grooves. Jenna! Ring hammer. Eslo. The base of the trigger guard's been filed down for a higher grip. Uh, and not only thank that, you for the raid. nearly every part of this gun has been expertly crafted and customized. Thank you, Omega. I'm under enemy fire. Secure the perimeter. Like a damn fiddle! How does it taste? That's damn good. Thank you so much for that Ray dude. Yes, he's being forced to continue his work. Appreciate it. Where? 
As low, Gina Har, hope you're having a great day. Happy Security is tight. Thanksgiving. If you disguise yourself as a scientist, you might be able to sneak in. Can we get Boy, so low, sounds good. There? We'll see, won't we? Tell me how to get to the lab. You had a good time. The safest way in is from the rear. First, you'll need to head north through the jungle. You'll come to a heliport used for shipping materials. Pass the heliport and continue north, and there will be a large crevice. Descend into that area, and you'll reach a cave. Move through the you cave, won, so of course and arrive at a mangrove swamp. After the swamp, there'll be a warehouse. If you're new to the channel, I'm Pudge007. Make your way through the warehouse, and you'll come out just south of the A lot of Metal Gear Solid, as you can see got here. It. Resident Evil, Mega Man, and just the various things. And I've got a blind retro <laughs> playthrough that I still need to get set In up for us to vote on. I will do that soon, I promise. sometimes be more useful than a gun. By doing this, I'll be able to hold a knife at the same time and still keep the gun steady. Good to see you, everybody. Thank you so way, much for being here. Love you guys. Between a gun battle you and that knife light. fight. If you're new, enjoy your time here. Considering that subscribe button, love to have you back. At 37 likes, right. too. Thank you Let's so get much. Going. Wait a minute. What now? You must be tired. Why don't you take a little rest? I'll be fine. You'll never make it in your condition. It's a jungle out there. There's still an hour before dawn. <clears throat> It's dangerous to be out in the jungle at night without a guide. What about you? I have to get back. I can't be gone for too long. They'll start to suspect something. Don't worry. I'll keep you updated over the radio. That's it? My orders are to Ezra? provide you with information. Mm. Nothing more. Oh. I see that. You look disappointed. Yeah. All right then. I'll do something. You're under turkey you. fire raid. Gotcha. You're under enemy fire. You're under turkey fire. I see you now. I'll stand watch until dawn. Now be a good boy and lie down. What's the matter? I don't know you well enough to trust you. How well do you have to know me to trust me? Pretty well. I don't know if I can trust anybody. Gonna get that? Sure. She's right, Snake. You should get some sleep. Although, in your condition, you really ought to be back in the ICU. Whenever you save the game and quit, you'll go to sleep. Sleeping allows you to gain back stamina naturally. Depending on how long you sleep, you may also recover naturally from sickness and injury. Uh -huh. When you're tired or hurt, the best thing to do is just get some sleep. So do yourself a favor and take a nap. Doctor's orders, okay? As yeah. that's true. Okay. Oh, a gift that someone posted on my Discord about that. Dark is carrying some guns. Come on. Forever.
the matter? We're surrounded. I see four of them. We've got company. It's the Ocelot unit. Let's get out of here. Hurry. Don't forget your gear. Here, give me a hand. We can use this to get to the basement. I'll get past them on my bike. I'll call you later. Okay. I'll keep them busy. Huh? Don't go dying on me now. Possible extreme metal lag guys, or who knows? I know, right, Mama Nita? Jeez. Good, my dude. At least on my end. Doing a tuxedo run on the European extreme. Literally impossible extreme mode. I don't want to play that mode like Azer at all. Right, you talking about Metal Gear Rising? What's wrong? Uh. 
revenge is yes i enjoy the dynamic definitely not a typical metal gear game but i enjoy it i enjoyed it Here. No, no, mama, you can use a gun. You just can't. You can't do CQC. Yeah, you can't do CQC. Hey, Ghost Panda! Alright, if I can get this dude that's on the, the seat on the uh, rooftop uh, out, I just can't see. That's probably who saw me last time. Yeah, right there. Halfway through what? The bottle or your drink that you made? What's up, Daniel? It's been a while. I don't remember that name specifically, Daniel, but maybe you did. I can't remember. But welcome in. Welcome back. Happy Thanksgiving. Fiddly poop. years. He said it's been a while, so sorry. It's been a little bit. Like he said. No offense. Where could he be? What you been up to, Daniel? Doing all right?
Okay. When he moves and then you go over, then they can shoot him. And once I get that, I think I'll be gold. I think. Gotta work. I gotta work tomorrow to focus. Bleh. Yes. more yeah their offense is better their deep LSU's defense is really good though still they just their offense just sucks One more. Can you take one more? Mother suck. I do this with this tuxedo, man. Jeez. <laughs> Move. Oh man. Poop. Come on.
Wait, I want it. Let's <sighs> wait, I want it. Man! Yes! Get down, dang it! Russia with love. My God. XP, what's up, dude? I know he's over there, but I can't remember exactly where. Hey, King of the Hills. Mom, neither you can. It's just, it's not really that. It's just because he can see me. Like, I get him all the time, Mom, and he, it's just... I can't get too close because he'll see me because this. I'm trying to do it with just doing the tuxedo. You shoot him in the foot. I'm still afraid he'll see me though. Either way. Ah, oh, there he is. That's cool, Mama. I appreciate you telling me. Yeah, there's a, I knew there was another way to do it. I was just scared he was going to see me from there, but yeah, that's a cool way to do it, too. All right. Thank you, Mama Nia. Thanks for the GGs, everybody. What's been up to, King of the Hills? You know, Bubba. Yeah, they actually won't wake up now. Interesting thing about it. they won't wake up at this point.
Thank you, Ezlo. I appreciate it. What's up, Shadow Wolf? What you up to? Chilling, good to know. Happy Thanksgiving, dude. Fine, big duck daughter. I'm trying to get him to roll out of here. There we go. Get out of here! Huh. Oh yeah, what about you? Did you get enough? I got enough. I've been waiting for this moment. That's it. That's the stance. I don't think so. What? A female spy? This bitch is wearing perfume. Stay where you are. I've had enough of your judo. I see you've got yourself a single action army. That's right. There'll be no accidents this time. You call that an accident? Well, it wouldn't have happened if you hadn't been showing off. What did you say? It's a nice gun, I'll give you that. But the engraving gives you no tactical advantage whatsoever. Unless you were planning to auction it off as a collector's item. And you're forgetting one more very basic thing. You don't have what it takes to kill me. We'll see. That thing only carries six shots. The Makarov carries eight. You have to get a feel for how many you have left. This is a high-class weapon. It's not meant for shooting people. This isn't over yet. Don't. Why? He's still young. You'll regret stopping me. Damn it! I've got to get back before he does! Not at all.
Right, get out of here. Get out of here. That's it. That's the stairs. Ugh. Working on. All right, here we go. Oh. Did I get the box? Or the bug spray? Or whatever? I didn't, did I? Damn it. Sorry, you died in vain. I didn't get the spray. Poop! Bug juice. Here we go. Dressing your stuffing? Uh, dressing. Dressing, for show. Zelda, you did. <laughs> for sure. Dressing. All the way. That's what we've always had. What about you? Listen to Eva. What's up, Eva? Snake, are you there? I'm here. Eva? Did you miss me? Oh, yeah. Did you make it without any trouble? No one saw me. So you're back with Volgan? In a matter of speaking. Yeah, I'm just with potatoes. Oh, he Andrew, hail to the yeah, yeah. She's here, too. Better be careful. Tesla, I didn't, actually. Thanks, I actually I will. just ate too well satisfied. Boss and I get I along pretty well, though. I guess we a lot traders better about have that. a lot in common. Why would anyone want well. a defect? Betraying your country like but that, just, I, I I just don't get it. Are you talking about the boss? Why'd you do it? Weren't you born and raised in America? Yes, in a small rural town. I never even knew there were other countries, other cultures, other ways of thinking. Until I went to work for the NSA. And one day, I found I'd lost faith in the things I'd been taking for granted. What did you see? What was it that made you want to change sides? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Try me. I saw the universe. The universe? Not the actual universe. The universe as the intelligence community yeah, sees it. Yams. Oh, man. I realized that the gravity in this universe was holding me back. That's all. People and countries are both changed by their environment. And by the times. That sounds like what the boss was saying. There's a world of difference between this country and America. But it's only a difference of position, a difference of perspective. Coming here made me realize something. Half of what I'd been told was a complete and utter lie. The other half was a conveniently constructed lie. Where's the truth then? It's hidden in the lies. Are you lying too? Who knows? I've been trained to make even the most severe falsehood sound like the honest truth. Weren't you? No. I... Believe, because I have to, even if it is a lie. That's part of my mission. I'll have to remember that. If you need me, give me a call on the radio. My frequency is 142.52. See ya. Hmm. 
Okay. Yeah, I'm dressing. I'm dressing. Well, yeah, and, and when we make it, we don't make it, and we don't. I a lot of the stuff we don't stuff it in the turkey. We just make it a separate dish. It's, some people make the stuff and stuff it in the turkey. Cook it that way. And I'm like, nah, it's separate. <clears throat> Gotta get that crock hat, y'all. Oh, Andrew, did she? That's awesome, man. You get to pass that on. That's awesome, dude. I remember you used to think I didn't think I would like yams, but I like yams a lot. <clears throat> we call them sweet potatoes, but yeah. Pepsi Man! <laughs> Go to sleep. Stuff your turkey. I don't think most people do now, but. Oh, heck yeah. Make you a turkey sandwich later on EXP? No. Yeah. Good way to do it right there. Oops. I did the serum. That's not what I meant to do. Andrew, okay. I'm not going to ask any questions, because I was about to, and I'm like, don't want to start anything. But okay, Andrew, I got you. Carl Hack, sure. If it's not too bad, sure. That's... I hate that happened. I wouldn't say that's funny, but I hate that happened. This part's gonna be kinda tough. Can you breathe here? No. It's not allowed. Sorry. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Look too good in my, in my suit. Scoop. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. That was, hey, that was a rough moment right there. Something. 
something wrong. Support unit, confirm their status. Oh, Carl, nice. C Castle crashes, Carl. I don't even care. I'm never going to play that game, probably. So I think you're good. Giant bat, well, that's cool. Nice. Happy Thanksgiving, Carl. Ah, come on. Yay. Apache! Hey, I'm wearing that tux for you, buddy. What's up, man? Yeah, happy Thanksgiving to you, my brother. The uh, speed running champion of the world, Apache! How's it going, dude? Good to see you, man. Wearing that tux. I, I, every time I see that tux, I think of you. <laughs> Yes. Oh, I, I saw your brother. <laughs> it's been too long. Jules von Vaughn, thanks for the ten dollar holla. <laughs> Thank you. Dude, the focus I know. His Twitter handle cracked me up. Oh, Apache, you're so sweet. That's tasty. That's tasty. Um. Yeah. You're. You're, <laughs> you think about the uh, uh, Carsey's lawyers on the thumbnail. <laughs> I just saw that a minute ago, cracking me up. That's tasty. <laughs> Good stuff, man. And love how people sometimes can never figure out that you're being so sarcastic all the time, and they're like, what the hell? Ah, you're here at last. Looks like the boss's info was right. Twice now you've made me taste bitter defeat. I look good, don't I? I thought you'd like it. Carl.
so funny. But you're mine now. And then of course people. Yeah, Juice. What does that want to go for? Leave us. Ends fate. Juice. Fight earlier old age. It's just you and me. No one to get in our way. Ocelots are proud creatures. You're there. They prefer to cry. What does that go for? Let us know, Juice. And thanks again for that generous donation. Really appreciate you, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. How about unmetal? If Apache was playing this game, he'd already have it beat twice by now. Twelve shots. Like, look, I've been streaming for about like three hours. He'd have this game beat twice already. <laughs> Plastic cog. This time I've got twelve shots. Next, hey, Snake Loves, what's up? I am sad. How you doing, Snake Loves 1911? Sorry, what's up? Oh, damn it. Damn! Wow, I suck! Touché. Dang it. I'm sorry, Apache. I'm showing... Go for whatever juice will make a decision! I missed my shot earlier! Jack or John snake. or Snake. What's your status? Shut up. I'm getting nervous. The patchy here, okay? Leave me alone. Batch, I'm not really nervous. I'm just being stupid. <laughs> Suck it! <laughs> Woo! Shot him in the dick! That's right! Right there in the gold ads! Ugh. Damn it! He found us. <laughs> Yeah, I could be blindfolded. Hey, look, I'm Apache. Blind playthrough. Awesome, lost. <laughs> Andrew, I know it's awesome, isn't it? I know that, so I gotta get good. Man. Andrew, that would be a good idea, though. That big event. I agree with you, Andrew. We should do something like that. I won't create a pole. 
you were lucky. We'll meet again. Living it to community. Oh no! Alright, which one? Which one? The suicide's not the answer. I know, Juice, it's amazing, isn't it? I know, this game's so amazing, I love it. Alright, sounds good, Apache. Appreciate you hanging out with us tonight, my brother. I'll be, I'll be going for probably another 30 minutes. Something like that. I gotta work tomorrow, too, unfortunately. But You can't lie. Kill him early. F that guy. <laughs> Alright. I'll leave that going for a couple more minutes. F that guy. That's what it. That's the way to do it. To get 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 it done early enough, huh? Oh yeah, Snake. I'm that good with that 1911. Oh yeah. And so I was off today. Back tomorrow. Yeah, take a paid leave day. Oh, you did, Snake? Sorry, buddy. You going back tomorrow? Streaming sounds stressful? What do you mean? Take the leave day. I got you. I got you. Nice. Back in the day, back and back in the day, back in the day, back and back in the day. Alright, once we get towards the pain, I'm gonna pee, and then whatever's at the mini, that's what we'll put that donation towards. Andrew, pfft. hey, I don't, I, I mean, if you did well with it, I wouldn't blame you. I just couldn't do it. Pee a lot while I can pee in there. That's true. I could. Good, Good point. I could. Oops. Let's got some crab. Oh yeah. Let's see. 
I don't need to smoke it. Yeah, I do. There. Juice. So in the in the game Metal Gear Solid Three, uh, you can take the, there's a there's a boss called the End. It's not as actually, and this is what this that's another thing that the Badger says. There's a boss called the End, but he's not the boss. The End, but the boss. The End is known as simply known as the boss or something like that. I'm screwing it up. Hold on, let me find it. Let me see what he said. I'm freaking fine. Just a minute. He says it every time when he streams and does his stuff, too. Hold on. <laughs> Speaking of, there he is right there. Top of my timeline. Uh, come on. I don't know if I can find it right away, but it's something he says all the time. Something along those lines. I can't remember. It makes you crap at crack up every time. Can't find it. I had to go back a while. Anyway, it's really funny. I'm pretty much just like. Then is a boss in Metal Gear Solid Three, but it's not the boss at the end. The boss at the end is known simply as the boss. <laughs> it's like, God, it's so confusing to people that haven't played. But anyway, the, you can either you can kill the end early before you actually do the boss fight. You can actually fight him, or you can kill him, have him die of old age. You can like if you like save the game and like have it to where a week passes by, which you can like alter the clock. on the PlayStation, or you could actually wait a week, which we wouldn't do, then... Um, then he dies of old age, so there's three different ways to take him out. And that's those are some of the ways there. Alright, let me pee real quick. Oh yeah. The end boss is the boss, but it's not the end. Yeah, there he goes. The end boss is the boss, but it's not the end. The end is not the end boss. That is the boss. <laughs> yeah. Oh golly. Okay. Well, I did the wrong thing. Gameplay. Looks like we're fighting. How do I talk between those two screens, Snake? Like, 
It's just something on OBS. There's different scenes that you can choose, but the uh, animation that I use that goes in between them. Something I created on uh, After Effects. But yeah, it's just a, you just you just click on uh, it's different scenes, and you can do a thing where it says scene transition. I created that transition. Pretty cool. Let's go. Thank you, Snake. I appreciate it. Yes, Juice. That's the one. Yes. of the boss. Ha! I am the pain. Ha! I will guide you to a world of anguish beyond your imagination. I'm sorry, Mom. <laughs> I never have. I've never really tried, no. I should. I know about kind of where it is, but no. I'm gonna need that shit. That's right. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, what am I doing? You're making this fun! Grenade! Oh, come on. Just... Oh, <laughs> yeah, man. No, what's up? Hey! Hey! So
What? I mean, God. Dang it. I'm sucking it up. The jammer. Please get him. Oh, my God. There we go. Oh, the food is nice. Hey, Rock. F1. That's right. F1. It's fine, right? Because that's gonna be sweet, dude. I still need to do that. Suck it! Been better. Sorry to jammer. It was good to see you and happy. Uh, for sure, it's been tough, but happy Thanksgiving to you, man. Get the bitch! Get the... Ah! The Fatality!
Gabby! Painful fart. Oh, yeah. As of right now, fighting the pain's winning. It's winning. Huh. Maybe one of these days I'll actually get some more subs. I'm like. Been at 7880 forever. I was at 7883s the most. It goes up and down, up and down like a sub or two. And I'm at, I was at 7883 and it's back down to 7880. Like, I just want to get to 7900 subs. What do I have to do for people to love me? God! I do more Metal Gear and I don't get anything else. What the? What's up with that, mother? Fortnite, here I come. <laughs> I mean, uh, why, thank you. Ow! No, the jammer would not happen. I'm not that. I'm not that good. If I was good at those games, yeah. Oh, I know. I'm just being silly. You know, yeah, because they're so long. Yeah, because the cutscenes, bruh. Fork knife. I yeah, I can't do those fork knife. Rick frack patty whack, give it a bone. This old man ain't going home. <laughs> With Halo, I haven't even tried it. Maybe I should try it sometime. Just see we see how it goes. Cause I can play it on PC. And it's free for anybody, right? Anybody can get it. Free to play, I mean. No, uh... No, it's not dark. It's not there. Oops. Yeah, dark loves some Halo, that's for sure. Yeah. Yeah. So, Fuchs, you've played it, huh? So, how is... How is the new Halo compared? Is it good? Halo Infinite, yeah, that's what it's called. I can remember. I'm probably gonna get caught here. I don't know what I want. As I just, yeah, I know. I mean, I'm not really too. I used to be so. I'm not worried about it now. I've got too many other good things to worry about in the world. I mean, I would love it, but I don't let it get to me like it used to. Nobody saw that. 
Dude, oh, that's awesome. Um, maybe I should try some. I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I will. Got nothing to see here. Working on it, pseudo. I have not, Andrew. No, 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 no! No! Oh, okay. I am good. Is he still there? Come back. <laughs> My goodness. Really, Andrew, that's pretty cool. I have not seen that. Oh my gosh, dude, that's scary as hell. Risk reward, huh? Going for it. Oh, shit. Nothing to say. HQ 
This is HQ. Patrol here. We're under fire. And What's going on? Respond. What's going on out there? Patrol here. We're under fire. Enemy position unknown. Commencing alert status. Acknowledged. Keep your eyes open. Ah, oh, thank God. Hey, what's up, Carter? Oh my gosh, I'm being raided! I'm under enemy fire! Secure the perimeter! On the Twitch side. Accounts. What a taste. That's damn good. Thank you so much for that raid. Thank you, dude. Oh my goodness. Which way we got? Magus 62M. You just started three for the first time. Where are you, Magus? Welcome. Big shotgun shuffle, Magus. Uh, anyone else that came in with that raid over on the Twitch side, thank you so very much. I hope y'all had a great time. Yeah, let me know where you're at. You're, you're at the, not where you're from, but you're in Illinois. <laughs> I meant where you're at in the game. <laughs> Not where you live. <laughs> I'm from Arkansas, by the way. And the intro part, okay. So you just got through with the virtuous mission. He just started Snake Eater. Oh, okay. Okay. Got a retrith, or I'm probably screwing that up, but thank you so much for that uh, coming in with that raid. If you're new to the channel, I'm Pudge007. We do a lot of Metagross Assault and Resident Evil Mega Man on this channel. We also rotate and we do um, through some other stuff like I have a blind retro playthrough section that I do, that kind of stuff. So you enjoy a highly interactive experience. Consider him that this is for Mega Man X4. The stage select screen for Mega Man X4. Love it. Such a great song. But yeah, guys, go be sure to sh uh, shout out. Welcome. There's where I'm, where I'm wanting right there. Thank you so much, dude. There is the link to their channel. I'm going to go ahead and follow you. Appreciate you so, so much. I hope you're enjoying your first... Is it your first playthrough? Yeah, be sure to give Magus if I got you a follow there, brother. First playthrough, well, yeah. So, this was a huge spoiler. We're, I don't want to get anything, anything too much, but it's, I mean, we're in huge spoiler territory for you right now, then, because we're already, we're in Operation Snake Eater right now, so. So, you played through Metal Gear Solid 1 and 2? Oh, man, I'm so excited for you, Magus. I wish I could, I wish, I don't, I mean, if, I mean, I don't want you. I don't want you to ruin your experience, so. But thank you so much for that raid. I hope to check out some of your playthrough of it later on. Uh, but yeah, such a great experience. And which Metal Gear games have you played? I guess some one and two. Metal Gear Solid one and two. I'm sure you haven't played the like original ones that came out in. All right, I appreciate it. Thanks for lurking, and uh, and thank you so much again for that raid, dude. Really appreciate it. Yeah, and I've played this game so many times. So if I'm if you like to watch me play, it's like why can I do that? It's like this game, I just played it so often. It's just insane how much time I've played it. Oh, his link's right here, Mommy. It's on. Uh, oops, that is not. Here's the link right here.
I, I shared it on uh, YouTube as well, Magus. Well, it's really the MSX Metal Gear, but I know what you mean. Metal Gear 1 and 2. Oops. Yeah, you're welcome. I mean, they can press the like button if they come in and hang out with us, I guess, over on the YouTube side. But. Yeah, you're very welcome. Oh, yeah, Mama, no doubt. People watching their first run of this game is so epic, isn't it? So awesome. Alright guys, after this next cutscene, if early is in the lead, that's what we'll do. If not, then we'll take it off the board and it'll be between fight and old age. Get down! Get down! Heck yeah. So he can throw his freaking wheelchair at me. And... Pa! We'll see what happens. That wheel just comes right at my face. BAM! Get your hands off me. I'm not going anywhere. Really now? How many times must I tell you? time you resist, your lover will suffer the consequences. Is that clear? Vulcan. Damn you! Tatiana, no! Hold it right there, traitor. You're pretty good. Pseudo, six dollar holla. What's that going towards, dude? Let's find out just how lucky you are. Watch closely. Three guns has a single bullet in it. All right. I'm going to pull Early. the trigger six times in a row. Are you ready? He <laughs> 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 <I> said early. <laughs>
Give it up already. There's no such thing as luck on the battlefield. Are you sure? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> You'd better stay in line from now on. The Cobras will take care of him. Thank you, Stone. Has the CIA dog been disposed of yet? The pain is dead. What? He may be a child, but he's definitely one of yours. I fear Khrushchev may have a hand in this. We have no time to lose. You must eliminate him before the final test. Don't worry. They'll be able to handle it. I'm leaving him to you, the fear. is always sleeping. Is he all right? The end is saving what life he has left in him for battle. Normally, he's dead. But he'll wake up when the time is right. <laughs> right early. And when he does, it will be the end for the boy. Sokolov isn't worth your love. You can entertain me until the rain stops. Oh, 30. Kuwabara. Kuwabara. <sighs> Yeah, I, can, I figured after I figured out you were doing a song, but I, don't, I can't remember how that song goes. The sorrow. Is that you? Sure, yeah. I didn't hit R1. Sorry, guys. All right. Looks like early is the winner. All right, let's take him out. Thank you, Sudo.
Yeah, just took him out, son. Turn that down, you both. Yeah, I didn't mess it up, thankfully. <laughs> Well, I already killed everyone else. Might as well just kill you. See you, buddy. Bye. <laughs> Dead. <laughs> oh, my poopity scoop. It says, turn that damn jukebox on. That's uh, something that the head coach for the Arkansas Razorbacks says. <laughs> yeah, since I killed him, I didn't mess it up, thank God. That would have sucked. Yeah, I didn't mess it up, thankfully. Oof. Oh, Zeki, I shot him like three times. Like, you ain't going, you, you ain't going to get away from me. Oh yeah, that semi auto I'll definitely get it. I got a few shots in instead of, yeah. This bolt action, I had to make sure I hit him the first shot. He already out of here. Let's go. Sorry, Gramps, you're going to die. I guess I can take that off now. Thank you for those that donated. Mominita, Juice, and Tudo. Appreciate y'all. I did see that. It was good. Nothing too crazy. What can I say? Huh? Who's that? Nobody.
thing. Retra, so in this game, you're being extreme if you get spotted. <laughs> Look at that box. If you get spotted, it's an automatic. Hey, Papa. Papa Patu. Um, it's a. Uh, it's automatic, like game over. So, oh, you know, your your health bar doesn't grow near as much. Um, you take more damage. Um, people can see you better. Um, and then you know if they spot you, it's a game over. How much for Snake's Revenge? Eleventy billion dollars. I do have Snake's Revenge. I have it. I have an NES. I need to play it sometime. Just to. You don't have to pay me for that. I just need to do it. But to do it soon? Oh no, man! It'd take a lot for me to have to do it and set it up soon to do it next, because it's it take me a little bit to get everything set up. say it yeah you know well the thing is i've i've never really it'd be a first time for me to play it too andrew so i mean like i own it but i've never played it so i know we can go in that other way but you can actually like knock on it and it'll come out a pretty cool thing you can do Yeah, I've never played it. Huh? Okay, just a second. <laughs> Another way you can get in. Never seen what cart? The cartridge? <laughs> Is that what you mean? Here, I'll find it. Hold on. Backwards. I got the thing flipped. That's what it looks like. Thanks for revenge right there. Andrew, we should, huh? Yeah.
God, that was close. Oh, come on! It's because I looked away a little bit. Oh, as the hell no. Suck it. Suddenly, Andro. <laughs> huh? I hear something.
think we're good. Yay! Open up our company. I can't remember how it opens. Yet. Oh my god, that was close! Oh my god, hey, Steel City! Happy right now? What's going on with you, Steel? <laughs> For some reason, it's so weird. They don't. The box are like, whatever. <laughs> oh, you did. All right. You got that PS5 still. Nice. If you're looking for Sokolov, he's not here anymore. Put that thing away, you'll spoil my drink. So, you're the intruder everyone's talking about. Typical capitalist dog. No manners. And who are you? You mean you've never heard of me? And you call yourself an agent? Very well. I know, Andrew. That'd be awesome. I am and Alexander still, so Leonovich Grani. The... A man of some importance, if I do say so myself. I am the foremost weapon scientist in the Soviet Union. And the head of the glorious Granin Design Bureau. This is the Order of Lenin. It is in honor of the greatest magnitude given along with the title of Hero of Socialism to only the finest workers. It was awarded to me in recognition of my brilliant contributions to society. Since the Great Patriotic War, I have created countless weapons in the service of our great communist society. It was thanks to me that we were able to stamp out the Nazi scum. It was I who created the basic design for the mobile ballistic missile system you know and fear. Oh man, after this cut, Sam will have to save it and stop. I didn't realize it was that late. I was having too much fun. You're crocked, aren't you? I'm merely drowning my sorrow because of him. I've got nothing to do but sit here and drink this crap. Him. Sokolov. 
It's him you're looking for, isn't it? Because of him, I have been stripped of my authority. Hey, my research has come to nothing. Look. It is a revolutionary mobile nuclear missile system. A bipedal tank. A bipedal tank? Yes, a walking tank. A robot. Are you familiar with the theory of the missing link between apes and humans? Well, this technology will be the missing link between infantry and artillery. A kind of metal gear, if you will. And this magnificent metal gear will mark a revolutionary step forward in weapons development. Metal gear? <laughs> but I won't be used so easily, no. No crying myself to sleep. For you see, I'm going to send these documents to my friend in the United States. What? These bastards will live to regret this. And when they themselves become the targets of my creation, they will know my true greatness. Yes, Sokolov's pathetic shagohan pales in comparison to my work. What are you going to do with a rocket engine on a tank? About Sokolov. A tank does not need a rocket. It needs something else. Look at these. Nice shoes. No. Legs. Legs that allow it to go anywhere. Just as when humans learn to walk upright. That is the real revolution in weaponry. Don't you agree? But, a fool's in charge, Joe Sokolov. And where is Sokolov? My project has been terminated. The philosopher's legacy has been handed over to him. What the hell are you talking about? The philosopher's legacy. Haven't you heard of the philosophers? The Colonel has inherited their immense legacy. Volgin's father was in charge of the Philosopher's money laundering activities. In the confusion of the war, he somehow ended up with their treasure. And Volgin inherited that treasure illegally. We never need to worry about the military budget. The development costs at our facility are all paid out of the Colonel's deep pockets. The weapons born here will be the genes for creating an entirely new form of warfare. The funding for my research came out of that legacy. Came out of it. Now, my money, my men, <laughs> all have been yeah, diverted right. to the Shagohan project. Tomorrow, they will be conducting the final test, while Sokolov is making the final preparations in the weapons factory at Volgin's main base, the Great Fortress of Grozny Grad. Here I am, a playing host to an enemy spy and drinking myself into a stupor. That's where they move. Wayne, I got mine found, yes. but everywhere. It's, it's hard for too. everybody in the entire of world, course. Wayne. Everybody. Hey. And I am You're home. not thinking of going to Grosny Are you mad? It's an impenetrable fortress. I'm sure it is. You'll be killed. I'll take my chances. Wait. What? Listen to me, you fool. I want to help you. Help me? To thank you for your compliment. What compliment? My shoes. Tatiana gave them to me. I wanted to thank you for complimenting me on them. I'll tell you how to get into the fortress. In return, I ask only that you get that idiot out of there and destroy the Shagohad. There is an underground tunnel that runs around the perimeter of the fortress. You should be able to use it to sneak into the base. Head for the mountains. The entrance to the tunnel is located there. Take this.
Help me, help. Ah, uh, that's... You I mean, passed maybe through a, a warehouse it's hard on everywhere. your way here, didn't you? Yeah. There should have been a locked door inside of it. Do you remember it? Uh... This key... will open that door. Beyond that door lies a vast jungle. You can climb up into the mountains from the far end of the jungle. Go back to the warehouse. Use the key to open the locked door and head for the mountains. Got it? Why are you helping me? Unlike Sokolov, the thought of defecting has never once crossed my mind. I love my country. I love this land. I cannot even imagine living anywhere else. I wish to remain a hero of the great motherland. I cannot bear the thought of being hounded into a corner and left to waste away. It is already dawn. You must hurry. I will remain here and nurse my troubles for a little longer. To capitalism! Okay. Can we escape? I think we can do it. Ah, huh? oh, damn it. Save me, I was in the box, okay? God! <laughs> Bob Saget! <Huh>? No! <laughs> what the? that sound. Oh, yeah, no, Sag, I know what you're talking about.
Huh? What's, What's that? that sound? Hello. And everybody, look what's going down. No, this is the actual PlayStation 3. I'm trying to do it with the tuxedo. Like, why don't you put this? I don't want to put the other uniform on because that's too easy. I want to try to do it with the tux. Huh? What's that sound? <laughs> now, this is the actual PlayStation 3. Yeah, Metal Gear Solid uh, HD Collection. Bought this in. Yep. <laughs> Shit! I never know where he's at! I mean it just now. Good lordy. Huh? What's that sound? Mother suckity suck! Huh? A favorite part of MGS3? Probably like a bittersweet part is probably the but the boss fight. The, I'm talking about the boss, like the very end boss. That's not the end, but the boss. <laughs> the last boss of the game, the boss. Pretty awesome. But the end boss fight's pretty dang awesome, too, though. Huh. Huh. Let's see here, bro.
Ah! Oh my gosh! This pissed me off. Pissing me off. Huh? What's that sound? Someone's in here. I need to go to bed. I'll try one more time. If not, then we'll just pick it back up. I won't. Have, I won't get to stream tomorrow. I don't know about Wednesday either. Let's see. Huh? Here, I should try to get. What's this. that sound? Someone's in here. <laughs> We can do this, y'all, for the love of God. Wow, that was super late. Much, how you doing? What's wrong? The box. Nice. A mild turkey. Oh, damn. Nice. No doubt. No doubt. What do I call you? I can't read that name, unfortunately. Happy Thanksgiving. Graz, Graz. Oh, wow. Hello. Suck it!
I was hoping maybe be far enough away. Bam! Yes, I know I could use the scientists, but I ain't doing it. Pretty extreme indeed. Hungry. Popping caps. What? Yeah, no, I was singing that. I was singing the wrong one. I can't think of the Christmas one, though. I know I've heard, I just can't think right now. I'm too I'm too tired. Alright, okay. I need to stop it right here. I really want to keep going. I'm having a lot of fun with you guys. But I gotta stop. Sorry. Oh, I need
Been going four hours. Has it been going four hours and forty minutes? Golly, I've been playing for a while. Saving the game, Snake. Yeah, I'm saving my game. Save my data, please. Here we're kind of. I've got to work tomorrow, or I wouldn't. There is a banger. PTO, yeah. Hey, Get Smith, right on that. you ever heard of Godzilla, King of Monsters? No, what is it? It's a movie. You haven't seen it? No. Nope. It's about this monster called Godzilla who grows to an enormous size in a nuclear test and goes on a rampage in Tokyo. Nuclear test, huh? Then the Over 60 likes to tonight, thank you. Giant monsters right about now. It's just make-believe. Maybe that's why my pants have been so tight lately. Snake, it's a movie, not a report out of Los Alamos. I know, yes, so then what happened? Godzilla is immune to all weapons, and humanity has no way to stop the monster. Dr. Sirizawa develops a new type of weapon, but meanwhile, Godzilla is getting closer and closer to Tokyo, obliterating everything in its path. It was originally a Japanese movie, but they made an American version, too. I recommend seeing the original Japanese one if you ever get the chance. It's mostly mindless fun, but it's also got a serious anti-nuke message as well. Where can I see the original? You'll just have to go to Japan. Really? That's too bad. Well, if you wait 40 years, you might be able to see it in America, too. Why is that? 2004 will be Godzilla's 50th birthday. You think they're still going to be making Godzilla movies, then? Of course. Everybody loves Godzilla. You sure know a lot about movies. I don't suppose you're the movie-watching type, are you? Not really. Okay, then I'll tell you everything I know. Oh, so did. When okay. the going gets tough, movies can save your life. It's always good Snick. to be able to look at things from a different perspective when you get in a jam. That's the magic of movies. No kidding. Well, I guess it might at least make a nice distraction. That's the spirit, Snake. Have a little fun. Okay. Snick. S N E K. Snick. That's how you spell it, right? Snick. Okay, let's see. Playing right. Uh, I, don't even know. I gotta go to bed. I don't know. That is arrangement. Oh no no no! I don't know what I was. No, I was. I didn't ask about that. You do have fireball for an hour. Good job. Good job. I hope you had a great Thanksgiving. I'll, I'll get. I'll try to. I'll try to do it. No, you're good. Happy. Oh yeah, happy Thanksgiving. I don't know if I said that to you. Happy Thanksgiving. Good. Yeah. Great. Yeah, good. Thanks for hanging out with me tonight, everybody. You guys are awesome. Thanks again for being here. Be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't. Try snake. Everyone. Every one of us. Everyone. So, thank y'all again. Hope you had a great Thanksgiving. Thankful for each and one of y'all. Love all of you guys and girls. Timmy! Timmy! Mariano, Dreamy, Andrew, DeFuca, Snake. The 1911s. Amanita. The Focus. Leandro. Kirakon. Juice Man. Russian dude. I don't know your name. Ezlo. Thanks for the raid, Ezlo. I appreciate it. Dry Great. Wayne. I probably missed somebody. Michael. Uh, McJuicy. Steel City. Pluto. Ugh. <sighs>
Bugles, <laughs> Bugles Lobby. Super Kiro Khan. Yes. All of you guys. Love y'all. Have a great Thanksgiving. Pro I know we'll get to stream tomorrow. It'll be a stretch if I get to Saturday. So either I'll be back Saturday night, maybe, or Sunday night. And I will see them for some more MGS3 action, and we'll take on the fear. But anyway, thanks again so much. I'll see you later. Have a good night, everybody. Adios.